All right, shalom, shalom, Akim. First and foremost, I to give all praises, honor, and glory into the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Baha Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Baha Hashem, Rukar Kadash. Let it get the bonus to my apostles and elders, a great millstone who rule well and told me the truth according to the Bible. And shalom to all the birds out there that the folk on the earth pushing this word and all racialness and sincerity. Belkazaba, you know, from the GMS DC camp. It's coming back with you another quick lesson through the spirit and power of your help by Shemuel Shai. As you see on the title of the screen, something I put this pen in my notes called Being on Fire. All right. Now, you know, once we're in this truth, okay, the scriptures tell us, you know, to be on fire, okay, not to be lukewarm, but to be hot, okay, to be on fire for this. Another word for, you know, having fire within you is a passion or, or a enthusiasm about this truth. You know, you got to keep on going. Keep, that fire has to be lit, okay? All right? And the scriptures tell us about, about being on fire. All right? And I'm going to get some scriptures and some definitions or as well. You know, we can, um, you'll be edified. It says, this is Second Peter chapter um, 1, verse 10. It says, wherefore the rather, brethren. So talking to the brotherhood, okay? Because it starts with the men first. All right? It says, Brethren, give diligence to make your calling and election sure. For if you do these things, ye shall never fall. Okay? What? If you do, if you're diligent. Okay? It says, what? The brethren to the brotherhood, those that are out there on the highways and byways, preaching this word in sincerity and truth. Okay? We're supposed to give diligence to make our calling, because that's what we're in right now. We're in a calling, all right? An election, sure. Now, what? There's the calling, but then there's those that are the elect, the election. Lord's will will be a part of that number of the elect of the nation of Israel. It says, make your calling and election sure, okay? That sure means what? Make, basically make it, you know, um, you know, uh, real, okay? You know, matter of fact, let's get this definition, the word sure, all right? All right. It says the word sure is from as an adjective from the late of uh, Salaki from the early 13th century. It says safe against attack, secure, firm. OK, this is mentally certain, confident. OK, so make your calling an election sure, confident that you're of that number. OK, because right? ultimately, you know, we're not going to we're not going to know until the end. All right. But what doing what we got to do, all right, to make it at the end of the day, okay? Doing what we have to do according to the scriptures, all right, to be found worthy to escape the said perils to come, as the scriptures say, okay? All right, that's what the elect or the election is going to receive, okay? All right, so it said what? Read again, it says, wherefore the rather, meaning moreover, okay, out of all the things that we need to do, okay, that that are a part of this truth, okay, all right, moreover, or, or what, what, the rather, brethren, give diligence to make your calling election sure. Now, as I see, as you see, I got this um, definition of the word diligence. It says the constant or earnest effort to accomplish what is undertaken. So uh, now we're in this truth, okay, you know, we, this is a battle, okay, this is a fight, all right, all right, we're supposed to deal with diligence, you know, constant and earnest effort, okay, to accomplish what is undertaken, to accomplish this fight, the end of the race, as the scriptures call it. This is a race, all right, but it's not like a quick race, but it's like a marathon, all right? And you got to keep on pushing until, at, we're, uh, until the end, and we're very, very close to the end, okay? It says, now I got another definition that you saw, and it said the constant or earnest, right, effort, right? Now I got the word earnest, it means serious or grave in speech or action. So it means what? A deadly serious. Okay. So not just a constant, but a uh, or effort, but what? A constant and with a deadly serious effort. Okay. Meaning what? You gave your life over unto this. Okay. That's what brothers have done in the spirit. Okay. And are doing now, Lord's will be part of that number. Or we, put, we put our lives on the line for this. Okay. You know, this is our life. We have dedicated our lives, 
All right, to to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. I heard a word in cause God in Jesus Christ. Okay, all right, to do what is commanded of us, which is to teach this word and to live this word. Okay, all right, and 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 Lord's will that we be what of the election. Okay, all right, of the elect of the nation of Israel. Now, here's another reason why we go hard because scriptures tell us about being on fire. Right, all right. We've come back to knowing who we are, the Israelites, according to the Bible, you know, according to our perspective tribes, okay, all right, as the children of the Most High, as the children of Israel, all right, the Israelites, okay, and come back to our power, Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, Yahweh being the true name of the Heavenly Father, and Yahweh Shai being the true name of the Word and He calls Jesus Christ. I want to get this, it says, Baruch 4 and 28, it says, for as it was your mind to go astray from the Most High, which it was. Okay, our people have, you know, walked away, so to speak, you know, from the Lord. Okay, you know, they have not sought the Lord for a long time. Okay, all right, and now, all right, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai has given back that, you know, us that spirit of seeking Him. Okay, and giving us His names uh, and understanding these scriptures. Okay, and the Lord's will be a part of the elect. The elect are going to seek Him more and more. All right, as we get closer and closer to the end of this rulership, the end of this world, okay? It says, so being returned, meaning now we'll return back to our power, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, who the word he calls God in Jesus Christ, all right, into our heritage as being Israelites. It says what? Seek him 10 times more, okay? So not only are you seeking him, are you being diligent, but now what? You're seeking him 10 times more means what? With a, that constant and earnest, deadly serious in speech and in action, okay, you know this is what we're supposed to do. That's what the scriptures say. What you know, it says. Wherefore, the rather mean moreover. This is how we're supposed to be, okay. All right, we're supposed to be seeking the Lord ten times more and turning back to Yahweh by Shmuel okay. All right, and here's one of the reasons uh, uh, why you would want to do these things, okay, that we would have mercy in these times and the Lord. Well, uh, uh, is going to have mercy only upon his elect, okay? So we're trying to make our calling election sure so we can receive the mercy of the Lord in these troubling and, and peril, uh, peril times, okay? It's perilous times. It says, this is the book of Isaiah chapter 55, uh, verses 6 through 7. It says, Seek ye Yahweh, okay? The Heavenly Father, through his only begotten Son, Lord Yahweh Shai, with the word he calls Jesus Christ. It says, While he may be found, because soon you're not going to be able to have uh, um, such an accessible access to the Lord. Okay. All right. It says, call ye upon him while he is near. Okay. Right now the Lord is near with his men out there in the highways and byways. Starting off with our apostles, elders, a great millstone to the mill and down like myself. Okay. All right. This word, seeking after the Lord, is near. The Lord has his, has what? Is near. He has his ambassadors out. Okay. He has his men out there. So he's near, but soon he's about to tuck them away. So he's about to be far, okay. But call upon him while he is near. Seek him while you while you may be found. Right? This is verse uh, fifty, uh, uh, verse seven, Salaki. It says, "Let the wicked man forsake his way." Meaning what? Because we were once in the world, okay, and we had a what a lifestyle about us, okay. That's what the word way goes into. The way you conduct yourself on the planet. It says that the wicked forsake his way, because we once like the people in the world, but well, you have to forsake that way, that lifestyle, okay? It says, and the unrighteous man, his thoughts, but the ways and the thought processes of this world, okay? We have to pit all of those things away, all right? It says, and let him turn unto Yahweh, okay? All right, let us return what? Unto Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, seeking him 10 times more, making our call on election sure, right? It says, and he will have mercy upon him. To see, this is a promise from the Lord. The Lord's going to have mercy upon those that do such things, which are the elect of the nation of Israel. That's why we're making our calling in election sure. We're being on fire, okay? So Lord's will will be a part of that number, okay? All right, it says, and he will have mercy upon him and to our power, for he will abundantly pardon. So we want that, okay? We want the Lord to abundantly pardon our sins according to the scriptures. All right, because what? According to the scriptures... If the Lord is not abundantly pardoning your sins, that means, well, you're not turning back unto him, which means the scriptures tell you that, well, all those that hate me love of death, okay? So you're going to have a great meeting with death if you don't turn back to the guy of the Bible. If you're not what? Being on fire.
Okay, all right. It means you're cold. <laughs> a body, when it's on fire, it's alive. All right, you know, it's alive. It's warm. All right, but when the body goes cold, that means it's dead. We don't want to. <laughs> we we don't want to be dead. All right, spiritually. Okay, because we just came back to life. All right, we don't want to be dead spiritually. End up what? Physically end up dying. Okay. All right, we want to be on fire. We're alive. Making our calling and election sure, being diligent with a serious intent, okay? The Lord's will that what? We be translated into the chariots who the warden and call UFOs, okay? All right, being saved from the said perils, all right, the destruction to come, okay? All right, so hopefully I just want to get that little quick lesson in the spirit about being on fire. You know, got to keep on pushing, got to keep on believing, man. Keep the faith, you know? All right, so if others have any more uh, scriptures that popped up in their mind, Hey, feel free to put it in the comment section below, okay? So with that, I'd like to give all praises, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Baha Shim, Yahweh Shai, Baha Shim Kadash. I'd like to give double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well and tell me the truthful coins of the Bible. And Shalawan to all the brothers out there that the full coins of earth pushing this word and the righteousness and sincerity. Until next time, to the elect, we say Shalawan.